N-A-Y-I-M-E-D-W-A-R-D dollar sign nigga N-A-Y-I-M-E-D Welcome back. My name is Naeem Edwards. I actually got a chance to sit down and look at this new Revolt TV thing. Uh, Carisha Please, that's Young Miami, if you are not familiar. She got a podcast slash show or whatever now. I only got halfway through it. That's not my type of media. That's not my type of entertainment. But I see where people will find that shit enjoyable. Not me. Now, I thought it was dry. I thought it was boring. The You can already tell. Like, she is an entertainer, though. But you, you got, there's got to be something that you would like. So, anyway, this ain't what this is about. This is about she saw food and she ate food. Diddy is a fucking plate. Like, she's doing it right. If you're going to be a bitch that come into this, that's the way you're supposed to do it. You're not supposed to just let niggas fuck you and take everything from you and you walk away empty-handed. You're supposed to walk away with a bag. You're supposed to walk away with money. Like, the motherfuckers is up there. I don't give a fuck about who a bitch date. I don't give a fuck about what a bitch do in her spare time. Like, she... Did it right. Them city girls, you can say what you want to. You can hate prostitutes, hate prostitute rap or whatever. But that is what you're supposed to do. You're not supposed to just let niggas take and take and take and take and take from you and not give you nothing. These, these motherfuckers is, they up there when it comes to being smart about what to get in return for some shit. Now, like, do I think, it, I mean, it could be speculation about if some shit is real or some shit fake. It doesn't matter if it's real or it's fake. Do I think the show's gonna last? No. But Diddy is just not the type of entertainment I will be sitting around and watching anyway. I think he's a genius. I think he's amazing. But entertainer-wise, not somebody I would want to see. Like, But that's me. That ain't my demographic. You know what I'm saying? That's that's not for me to say if it is or if it ain't. You know, uh, I think that they smart. Because this will be something, you know, people continue to watch and get paid. Now you open the door for more opportunities, but it's just easier to brand women. It's once you get a woman to go, it's easier to brand them. They can do more. They can talk about more. The floodgates are open more because she's a woman. Now she can bring in and push whatever agenda she want. She can do whatever she want to do. Because she did not, is there a cat hair on my lip? She did not allow somebody to come and just take and take and take. And again, I want to attribute that to the people that's behind her. Ain't no being no rap bitch dating no motherfucker and you not walking away with something that will put money in your pocket. They even went, you know, a little bit deep. The half that I watch, I'm probably not going to go back and watch the other half, but like, Regardless of if you think this is going to last, regardless of if you think it's good, the mindset is there. The nigga got licked and she need to keep licking. They need to keep licking because music is not going to last forever. You need to be able to do other things. You need to be able to have other avenues. You need to take advantage of this music. And actually, this shit can prolong the music, you know? So I think the City Girls, Harisha's doing a great job. Uh, if they have more entertaining, more interesting topics, I guess maybe I'll keep an eye on that. Who knows? Because she is funny or whatever. So, my name is Naeem Edwards. What's N-A-Y-I-M-E-D-W-A-R-D dollar sign, nigga. N-A-Y-I-M-E-D.